Once in a lifetime experience now less than 10 uh, days away. Our team at WTOL is preparing for the solar eclipse over a year. We know there's a lot of excitement. We could see a ton of tourism April late. That means traffic, demand for gas and groceries, a lot of people getting our first look at the weather for that eclipse day. John, what do we know for now? Well, Dan, it is trending milder than normal and early April can really be a wild card weather wise. I want to go over a few past April 8th and just how variable this time of year can be. A year ago on April 8th, we saw full on sunshine in 2023. Pleasant temperature of 59 degrees. That is near normal for April 8th. Now the year before it was damp, cloudy and showery. Even though we only got two hundredths of an inch of rainfall, it was cool and cloudy with only a high of 51 degrees the year before though and this really goes to show the volatility of early April summer feeling temperatures in your 80 quarter inch of rainfall and it was one of those days where the sky was sunny one minute and storming the next so here's what I can tell you about this April 8th that is now at the tail end of the 10 day it is trending milder not just here in the Buckeye State but a good portion of the country partly cloudy sky conditions with a high temperature likely above average we are forecasting highs well into the 60s with partly cloudy skies. You'll see the total solar eclipse forecast in my 10 day in just a few minutes. John, thanks. We're putting together an hour long special on the eclipse. You can watch it tomorrow from 5 to 6 p.m. right here on WTOL 11 or catch it streaming now on WTOL 11 plus.